Hi everybody, it's the Gerg. We're gonna rock some Graveyard Keeper. Uh, I, I had a bunch of playthroughs before. I lost some of the videos for the new ones, so we're gonna restart this for you guys and gals to enjoy. This will be. I will record and upload weekly. Hopefully, um, hopefully that works out. Uh, but we're gonna try to play the game and get everything done. I'm gonna try to achieve at least one goal every time I play. So that'll be the name of the actual chapter. So hope you enjoy. Hope you watch. Love your faces, and let's get to it. By the way, my webcam is broken. My webcam is broken, so my little avatar guy is going to be over there making weird faces. So, hope that doesn't freak you out. Um, hopefully you enjoy. Love your faces! Alright, so we've played before, but we're going to actually start a new game, so let's do that. Let's load in to Graveyard Keeper. Uh, it's an ordinary day, and our hero is hurrying home where someone very important is waiting for him. Even in everyday routine, there's a place for loving and feeling loved. Especially when you know that someone misses you. Aww. Aww. Ah. What happened? Where is everything? Calm down. You're merely turned a page in your life. You've merely... A whole new chapter awaits you ahead. But I need to go home. Can I go home? There's always a way to get home. Hmm. Let me see. Your new home is a graveyard. Thank you, Undertaker. Does that mean I'm dead? It means you're a graveyard keeper now. But I need to go home to my love. Then you need to be a good graveyard keeper. You should dig up Jerry. He'll help you sort everything out. Who? All right, what a strange vision. What is this nightmare? Okay, let's find Gary. It's Jerry? Gary? Jerry? I'm gonna say Jerry. It's Jerry. All right, let's go. All right, we're gonna exit out. All right, so Jerry is apparently here. Let's dig him out with our hands. Uh, boom! <laughs> Holy sword, I'm a skull. Are you Jerry? <laughs> hmm. Why would you think I'm Jerry? A man with a red eye <laughs> told me that I need to dig. <laughs> I need to dig up Jerry. A red eye. I remember. <laughs> oh, sorry. That's right. I'm Jerry. How did you find me? <laughs> the man. <laughs> the man told me that you'd answer all my questions. The man. Good, good. But first, let me ask you who are you and where the sard are we? I must be dreaming. None of this can be real. Hmm. You're the new graveyard keeper. What else do I remember? Let me think. I remember that sound. Let's go check it out. Everything is so strange. None of this makes sense. I definitely remember that bell. And a donkey? Something is very wrong with that animal. Hmm. He could be dangerous. Alright, let's go talk to the donkey. Hi, donkey! Blueprint. Donkeys of the world unite. Alright, we've unlocked a new technology. I do have all the DLCs, by the way, so uh, just keep that in mind, okay? <laughs> Got a fresh corpse for the town. Got a fresh corpse from the town. Wow, a uh, talking donkey. Uh, you, you can understand me? Let's talk. Who are you? I'm cheap labor. This card isn't mine, so I have to work for the capitalist bastard who owns it. And I only earn five carats a day. This situation is deeply humiliating. You know where I'm coming from, right, comrade? The bastard pretends that he doesn't understand anything I'm saying. Anyway, I need to go back to the town. You get rid of this one, and I'll bring you a new one. What a strange land this is. Don't run away with my body! Damn donkey. Hey, what are you staring at? Grab that juicy corpse while it's still fresh. What for? I feel like we should take it to the morgue. I don't remember why exactly. But I'm pretty sure it'll be fun. And might be profitable. Oh, I'm going to puke. Let's do it! 
All right, we're going to do questionable things, guys and gals. So just, you know, just have that in mind, okay? Use A to pick up and drop large items. I am using an Xbox controller, by the way. Because I think it, it's easier. Sorry, I like this place. Feels like home. Put the body on the autopsy table. Man, I've heard that a thousand times. Then, hmm, what's next? Oh, yes. Slice some flesh from the corpse. That should be good for starters. What? No way. This isn't right. Sure, sure. It's not right. How can I forget? Maybe because I'm a talking skull with amnesia. Is it right that you don't know where you are? Is it right that I'm a skull? Nothing is right here. So shut the sard up and do what I tell you. You promise you'll tell me how to get home? You just need to trade the meat in the village tavern for a beer. Talking skulls never lie. And then bring me the beer. I bring the beer to me. <laughs> All right. So we unlock blueprints. This is what you unlock as you uh, as you move up achievements. Uh, we got a preparation place, a pallet, and we can extract flesh. We can extract flesh. Man, I can't talk, talk today. Good time to start this, right? All right, so we're going to go in. Uh, we're going to click on that. We're going to extract it, and then we need to do the work with Y. Ooh. So now we can create a burger, create a sandwich, and create baked meat. That's disgusting. You'll get used to it. So what should I do with the corpse? I don't know. Let's bury it. Uh, take the corpse. I'll wait for you in the graveyard. Okay, so, all right. So we got to click on him again and take body. Carry it out. Make sure you don't throw it off your hands. Make sure you see the exit sign because I do that shite all the time. I do that shite all the time. Um... Okay, so we're gonna throw him down. All right, let's go talk to Jerry. Uh, okay. Let's bury it. Okay, use the blueprint desk at the graveyard. Mark a site for the grave, then dig it with your shovel. Carefully put the body or what remains of it in the grave. Bury and decorate. Warning, do not use goat skulls and upside down stars for decoration. I'm like a lot of you, I wish you could do that. Okay, so we need to go here. All right, we're gonna do a grave site. Um, let's do one over here, cause there's not like, and I try to do the cross pattern like they have. It makes it a little bit easier. Okay, there's that. So we gotta take this over. Gotta throw the body on the ground. We need to walk up and why. We have a shovel. All right, there we go. Pick it up, throw it in, and bury it, baby. Uh, okay, nicely done. We got a burial certificate. Hmm, the sparrow certificate. I remember. Money. Alcohol. Alcohol. Hmm. I sure used to like it. A lot. Oh, sorry. Here comes the bishop. He's your boss. That is the bishop. Oh, oh, I know. Ask him about the burial certificate. He should know something. I better leave now. I'll be in the morgue. Waiting for my beer. Ah, he's out here! Bye, Jerry! Dear me, I'm so tired. Why... Why do I have to come here every week? Okay, let's go talk to him. Talk to the bishop. Oh dear, the new keeper. Hmm. We've been expecting him for 30 years, but he pretends there's nothing wrong. I'm sorry to have to tell you this, but your graveyard is a mess. There is no way I'm promoting you to cleric until you fix it. Okay, so, to, uh, tutorial locations. Uh, current location name is up top. Important location information, the graveyard quality, uh, is like a skull with a thing around it. The church appears with a, a pill as a cross, etc. Repair graves to increase the graveyard's overall quality. Um, and you probably need special resources to do that, so we'll have to make it up. Uh, what would that, what is, <laughs> what is that considered around the skull there? We're not gonna talk about it. Create a wooden marker. Okay. As soon as your graveyard quality is at least five, I'll be pleased to promote you. You look like a special, you look like a spiritual leader. And I'm a good judge of character. Haha. <laughs> I'm good at everything. That's why I've, I was chosen to represent his will. Haha. <laughs> your predecessor used to keep this stuff in a trunk somewhere here. You should check it. 
I'll come by next week. In fact, I come here every week on that little symbol. Ah, uh, those little symbols are very important. Remember them. I can never remember them. Maybe I'm not dreaming. Did I eat something? Oh, he's waiting. What should I say? Why is it you come here? It's part of my duty. The unpleasant part. It's kind of an old tradition. I don't know how much... I, I don't know much about all the traditions and rituals. I'm just here to represent his mighty and glory. Ha ha. I have one tiny question with the burial certificate. As soon as a body has been laid to rest, you could trade its burial certificate for money at the village tavern. Okay, uh, you've unlocked a new technology and got the blueprint. Bishop's choice. New task. Ah, okay. I'm not the keeper. I was going home from work. Uh, listen, this is not a good thing to start out with, okay? Um, so, just not a good thing to start out with. So, I wouldn't ask that too much because it kind of gets in your way. So, we're not going to we're not gonna ask about going home and shit. It just gets too much. We're not going to ask about going home at all. Just repair all the graves. It wouldn't take me even an hour, but it's your job. Can you tell me more about the burial certificate? It is your payment for laying our brethren to rest. It's all part of an ancient contract between the town and the village. As soon as the body has been laid to rest, you can trade the burial certificate for money at the village tavern. Oh god, this seems too complicated to be a dream. Okay. Okay. We're not... Uh, let's, uh, let's ask about the town. Oh, the town is the heart of the glorious land, the palace, the cathedral, everything is there. You should see it for yourself. Hmm. But if those clothes, that would be a rather funny. That would be rather funny. Haha. -ha. How can I get to the town? It's not far from the village. Just head south from the tavern. Okay. No more questions. Um, uh, wait a minute. I'm not gonna do the. I'm not. Gonna, I'm not doing the other one. If you run out of the repair kits while fixing the graveyard, you can always craft new ones. Okay, to craft new items, you'll need to unlock the, the relevant technology. This costs tech points. Press the double square button, which Xbox is over, to open the technology tree. Red points represent your handcrafting skills and your ability to work with materials. Green points represent your knowledge about the nature of things and nature itself. Blue points represent your spiritual knowledge of the immortal world. You'll get your first blue point at the study table in the church basement. You earn points simply by doing anything. Also, you can get points by studying new items at, at a special table. All right, so basically, those three things you need to remember, they're very important. I can never remember. Uh, blueprint stone, uh, so we got, we unlocked a blueprint stone uh, stockpile and gathering stone rock. You can collect a small piece of stone from a small rock or get a huge piece from a big one. Uh, you've unlocked new technology. Blueprint. Timber stock pile. Gather small tree felling. <laughs> Chop down a tree, a small tree to get one log. Uh, gather a stick. You can also collect sticks from dry dry bushes. I didn't realize that. Oh, yeah, I did. Never mind. Okay, so that's unlocked. Uh, then we can do sawing and stuff, but we have to get more points because we don't have enough points for any of this stuff. So that's not going to help us do anything. Okay, so he wanted us to check this. Oh, okay, so we have a uh, wooden repair kit. We have a stone repair kit. We have an axe, a uh, rusty pickaxe, and a hammer. Okay. Okay, so we got that. So we grabbed all that. So I think if we go to a grave, like one of the ones that don't suck. Okay, so if we go here, I think we can pull this out, right? Yeah, so we can dig this up and it actually takes, it gives us a point. The other thing we can do is if we go to some of these graves that have like, okay, so see the wooden cross is bad. I think we could actually fix this gravestone. That should make us get points. And then we can go here and fix this. And that should help with points. So we gotta do all that stuff, but we're not gonna do that here. We can do that anytime. We can do that in between times, which is the best way to go, by the way. We can do that in between times, do that like later. It's I don't know why I'm grabbing this. I should just go. All right, 
So you know what? Actually, um, we're gonna we're gonna end this. We're gonna end this here. We're gonna end this right here. Uh, I'll be back for the second part of this. We're gonna try to do 15 minute uh, episodes instead of 30 because 15 is just insane. I mean, 30 is insane. People have uh, it's YouTube, so like the the shorter, the better the attention span will be. So all right, love your faces. Thanks for coming and watching this. See you on the next episode. Peace and hair grease. Bye, everyone.